Hi guys, Scarlett here, and yes, I'm in my onesie, and so basically, I've got my sock on, and I've got my point shoes. Now, I'm going to be teaching you how to tie them. Point shoes, yeah, I get it, they widen, like, they get really, really widened out. But what you're meant to do is, you're supposed to, um, I just tried to film, or previously take film this even, um, and it just failed to death. So, yeah, so... You tighten these if you want the basis. People don't necessarily tie these things in a, in a ribbon, but it's no harm done, and it will actually keep your point shoe from loosening whilst you're dancing. So that's actually really, really good. Now you're just gonna tie it, and then get your. I'm gonna actually, because I told you in my previous video that I had a toe pad. So you just tie it in a normal ribbon. You just tie it in a knot, and then yeah. Um, uh, because this just like gives my left toe that extra support that I need on my left side instead, because it's just like it's just helpful. It's different for every dancer, but that's just how it's good for me and stuff. And it, by the way, if you're wondering um about point shoes, make sure you get them specially fitted, because getting them fitted is really important. So what you do is let me just put the camera facing the shoe more okay so you get it and then you wrap that one around like that and then you wrap this one around too okay and then at the back you tie a little knot and I just tend to do ribbons I tie my ribbons differently to how most people do them so don't mind me when I'm tying my ribbons. And then some ballerinas took them in. I don't want to tuck mine in now because I just can't be bothered. But that is how you tie. Oh, my camera fell over. That is how you tie a point shoe. And tip it back to class and get on with it. Bye, guys.